Well, this is the day. This is the Saturday, day three. Oh man, it's hard to keep track. Yeah, it's day three of Comic-Con. And anybody who wasn't here the last two days has come out in droves. The place is just hopping. Everything, everybody's out here. They're all having a good time. It's a beautiful day here in sunny, sunny San Diego. And there are just thousands upon thousands of people out here. It never, never gets old coming out here, seeing all the crowds, being here in the atmosphere. It's really, really amazing. The whole town is literally just turned into Comic-Con, just the displays, all of the installations, all of the different costumes. It's just crazy. I'm heading inside. I'm going to meet up with the guys. I sort of uh, started the day late. Had some uh, breakfast with some good friends. So, yeah, just looking to catch up. It's going to be more of a chill day today. Uh, tomorrow we're heading out, so I wanted to make the most of it. All right, guys. Right, we'll catch up with you later. I want to watch it, dude. I want to watch it, absolutely. It is just a sea of people out here. This is like crazy. White Ranger, you look awesome. Day three. Look at all these people. You think there was a Comic Con going on or something? So much, that was so awesome. <laughs> awesome, dude. Thank you so much. Okay, so I found the guys. We're heading back in. This is. This is crazy. This is insane. Let's take a look at some of the other exhibits that we haven't had a chance to look at. You say you lost both of us really quickly? Oh, nice. Wait, look left, I was like, oh. One of us is looking at a different thing. That is the problem. It's a visual history of the Transformers. They're only being handed out here today. 
pretty, pretty cool. I was hoping to get snag a um, one of the Unicron posters, but I'll try again later today. Maybe they'll maybe they'll give them up. But this is actually pretty neat. How your ding dong? That is a okay. I've never had a ding dong before. I never thought I'd say that in public. Should one eat ding dongs in public? Is that actually a thing? Joe Louis. Is that what it is? No. It's a Joe Louis. It's a ding dong. Oh wait, the fear butter. Look. I don't mind. Then you might have a chance. I hope. I doubt very much. Well, with that attitude. Brother, I've been, I've been, I've been having the right attitude all weekend, but it just. Really Come back. I'm at the Tamashi Nations booth, and they have some really cool connections here for Dragon Ball. But what really caught my eye was this: they have a new line of Cowboy Bebop toys. Pretty cool. If you're an anime fan and you haven't seen Cowboy Bebop, you're missing out. These ones look pretty amazing. Looks like they only have three toys so far. Still, pretty cool. So, okay. buy one of Carousel of Gundam, get a second Carousel of Gundam. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you get two Gundam No worries. Gundam 40th anniversary. They're just going crazy with Gundams right now. It's freaking amazing. Yeah, yeah. And then the Frank Yeah. Yeah. From Lafayette. Yeah, there. Oh, I hear that. Did you play the final lesson? No, I didn't. Amazing amount of detail in these. Leave, and then I turned around, and all of a sudden, I see the King of Monsters, Godzilla himself. Holy crap! Now, unfortunately, you can't buy this one. Actually, I don't know if you can. Maybe you can buy him. I don't know, but he's gigantic. Whoa! Excuse me. Sorry. Sorry. It's okay. The detail is amazing. What's in his mouth? Is there anything in his mouth? Oh my gosh, it's little people. Little people are in his mouth. The king of the monsters, guys. Godzilla. Go ahead, go ahead. I missed out on the pre-order, but at least I get to see it in real life. Here is Dairuger 15. Vehicle Voltron, holy crap. Yeah, it was a long shot to be able to get this thing. It pretty much sold out in like five minutes as soon as the pre-orders came on sale. And it's hilarious because Vehicle Voltron just was not that popular. But time heals all wounds, I guess. Look at that. He is impressive. Yeah. Amazing. Oh, this way. <laughs> yeah, it's 
try my best to get to the Weta Workshop. They have some amazing stuff here. And there might be a few people here who we actually might know. I've heard a rumor. And we've come to see if it's true or not. Comic-Con adventure, right Jordan? I guess so. I don't want it to be done. <laughs> I don't want it to be done. Jordan is so excited. He's very, we're all really happy to be together this year. Uh, it was kind of a minor miracle that we were able to do this, but you know what? It was a hell of a lot of fun. Um, we're going to be heading out towards... Hello. <laughs> we're going to be heading out towards uh, the 
what is it? The the Comic Con the Comic Con Museum, right? Is that what it is? Comic Con Museum. Yeah, apparently there's a Batman uh, 80th anniversary exhibit down there. Really looking forward to that. Uh, and we're gonna catch you in a bit, I guess. But in terms in terms of Comic Con and this place, I think this will pretty much be it for me. But Jordan gets to stay, stay one more day here without me. But that's okay. He's gonna he's gonna go enjoy himself. And we'll see him back in Toronto. All right, guys. We'll catch you soon.